Okie doke, so I just had a good long hot bath, shower, and drying off. Isn't that cool, whatever that means, but anyway, drying off. Ah, busy today working on some brass artifacts and cleaning them up, getting some of the old paint off them. That's kind of intriguing, and then, hmm. Other than that, what else I'm doing? I tried um, different types of Dremels with little um, wire wheels, but they're not really worked that well. So I started using this to go by hand, you know. Hi! This will blow your minds, I'm sure. I get comments sometimes, but sometimes I don't. They just too embarrassed to leave a comment. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh well, I wouldn't be doing this in real life because all the internet, Facebook, fun book, and other places just funny, stupid stuff. Anyway, I'm having fun doing funny, stupid stuff. Ha! How long was I in the bathtub? Maybe an hour, I think. Mm, it was fun though. It was nice. It felt good doing work all week. And sometimes I could take two baths three sometimes in the summer. Uh, like that. Well, best to keep clean, right? Other than that, uh, hmm, am I recording, number one? Hey, yesterday we were having fun with a pulse flash unit. Weren't we? Hmm? Yes, we were. Oh, now today... I'm doing this thing after, oh well, you know, I'm gonna dry up here and just do a ridiculous, useless video, which will surprise some people, of course, and not surprise them. <sighs> yes, totally insane, I love it. Oh, um, yeah, I'll have to get my English, English accent back, you know. Just to do the Englishman all the time, you know. Ah, yeah, yeah, it's in the shower. Make sure no tits are showing. We don't want to have that problem, don't we? Hmm? No problem. It could be a big problem on social media if the titties are showing, but we can't have that now, don't we? Hmm? <laughs> so you have a bee in your bonnet. Tell me all about it, thank you. A bee in your bonnet. Well, you know, I was going to do another video being serious. The hell of it. No. I'm longing for sprung time. Sprung, spring time, doctor. And, and, and. <laughs> so how many of you characters out there are real and how are you, how many are you totally fake or just who knows who you are? It's interesting, isn't it? I know some people in person that comment sometimes on my ridiculous, useless, most incomprehensible, stupid social media videos. See, you can pretend you could be somebody else on social media. Basically, you have false profiles and all of that, and you don't use your real name normally. I, I've had a lot of that happen to me, you know, I get all these messages and I don't know who they are really. I do get a lot of, um, how oh, you're cute, honey, all those things come in messenger all the time. And even on Facebook, I say, oh, thank you. I play along with it, you know, and just who cares, it doesn't matter anyway, it's all fake and that. Anyways, oh, thank you, darling. You know, it's kind of funny. But I'm noticing that, unless it's good videos, I guess that's extremely boring. God. It's very boring. I usually search things on video and find some good information on grounding techniques with tuning system to ground from radio. That kind of thing, a machine tool operation. 
and um, history stuff. I was watching last night this gentleman who interviewed the actors of Star Trek, the original series. It's quite interesting to see James Doohan being interested and Major Brett Roddenberry being interviewed and many others. And it's kind of intriguing to hear their real story instead of what you think they are. It's, it's interesting how they feel being typecast, you know? So, you got a little bit of that with those TV shows I did. So, it sticks in their head and they always say the government shut them down and all this stuff. Or some other stupid thing. But hey, who cares? So, here I sit in my kitchen grand with a can of carnation milk in my hand. No tits to pull, no shit to fling, just to punch a hole, no son of a bitch of a thing. Woohoo! Now, is that allowed on social media? Oh, my mother was, I think I take after my mother. She was pretty, pretty far out there. She believed in aliens, she believed in all kinds of things. She dressed up all the time when I was dating. And all cool, fun stuff, blowing up stuff with guns and stuff like that a long time ago. Mm -hmm. She's a real character, so uh, she dressed me up in her clothes and we'd start laughing and I'd ham it up like there's no tomorrow. Which I do, which I do, number one. So the social media and my psychiatrist I doubt it, because I'm more of a real life person. I would get involved with real people and joke around too. I get a little more dynamic in real life. <laughs> oh, anyway, I guess I should get going here. Whoop! Should I edit that out? Something showed, I better not show it, huh? I don't know, I think it's okay with men to show their tits, I think. I don't know. I'm just being cautious, you know? Okay, you guys take care, I gotta go.